Art has always been an important part of the Sacramento community, but recently, street art has become more popular as a new generation of artists works to beautify the Sacramento area. Many local entrepreneurs have hired local artists to come and beautify the sides of their buildings in order to provide a message to the public. So if you want to say that your restaurant is great to chit-chat at, or if you want to say that the owners are the funniest people alive, there's an artist that's going to be able to make this vision come to life. Mary Stedman is one of these artists. I'm Mary Lorraine Stedman, and um, how do I express myself through art? Well, I've been drawing since I was a long time, and it's kind of a therapeutic thing. It's kind of a way that I get out my imagination. I'm also right, so it really helps visualize stories. For murals in particular, usually I'm helping somebody else out create their own vision, and it just feels nice to help people. The street art troupe Few and Far has also been one to help entrepreneurs bring their creative vision to the public, while sharing their own artistic perspective. The piece they did for the Maverick Salon on I Street helps to accomplish this, while also giving the public an idea of what the entrepreneurs think is a great hairstyle. But most importantly, it helps beautify a part of the building that would otherwise be neglected, the parking lot. Other businesses have done the same thing, contracting muralists to beautify their parking spot while also bringing the spotlight to art styles that are often left out of local museums. Many styles have come out of this, especially pieces that tend to reference more famous works, like Starry Night by Vincent van Gogh. Going around Sacramento, you'll find many other pieces of street art that tend to express artists' own opinion of what it means to live in the city. And most importantly, to remind us that Sacramento is a beautiful place to live. Adriana Gomez, AccessLocal.tv